I can't feel my tongue. I don't think I'm able to speak at all right now. Hey everybody, what's going on? From Rock Solid Gaming, I'm Brady Godden, and you're watching The Hot Seat, where we put our guests through a series of wings to see how hot they can truly handle. The show is presented by Rock Solid Gaming and sponsored by Rocketeer Treats and Winging It. Check them both out for your sweet and spicy cravings. On today's show, she's been featured in two shows on 5TV1. She is on TikTok. She has an Instagram, Miss Brie Follett. 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 Miss Brie Follett. Sorry about that. You dumbass. All right. Um, thank you for coming on the show. Appreciate it. Thanks for having me so much. No worries. No worries. Um, okay, so hot stuff. How are we? Um, like Frank's and Sriracha. <laughs> it's hot? Yeah. Okay. So you wouldn't go to Wing It and order wings? I would, but like the bandit ones. All right. So first of all, before we get too much into it, tell the people, tell the audience watching all about you. I'm 23. I am the world's best bartender. I'm also on TV every now and then. And I'm a comedian. Wait, like an actual comedian? No. <laughs> no? I was in your Twitter bio, it's a Twitter <laughs> comedian. Okay, so yeah, so we'll get right into it. You watched the show, you've seen Cord's episode. Yes. Did you come hungry? No. No? I came afraid. Fair. A lot of people do. How much am I, like, do I need to eat? Not the whole thing. Okay. If you don't want to. Mmm. <laughs> no, not good? <laughs> or is it good? That was good. Okay, so what got you into content creation? Um, I, like, talk a lot. And so I wanted to, like, have an outlet for that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because see your TikTok is, like, full of more so events than anything. To be honest, my social media is a lot of thirst traps. That's cool. That's yeah. cool. It's a, it's a way to make money. <laughs> it is. It was good money. Mm -hmm. No, wicked. All right. So the second one, Chipotle. This is a milder one. Chipotle. Let's get it. Come on. Your drumsticks are in the flats. Flats. Yeah? Yeah. What's so? Easier to eat. You find it easier to eat? Hot? Huh? Yeah. I'm afraid. You seem a little bit nervous. I am. Oh, yeah? I want to die. No, you won't. I don't believe you. Is it already hot? That won't catch a lot of people. You'll be fine. Uh, it's not the Chipotle I'm used to. No. I don't know why it's called Chipotle. It doesn't taste like it, does it? Ooh-wee. <laughs> Going back to your TikTok stuff, um, and you trying to talk about thirst traps, what's your favorite piece of content to make on TikTok? The transitional videos are good too because like catch it, they're eye catching. All right, so the next one is jalapeno, jalapeno. Okay. This is one. This is a crowd favorite. Okay. Trust <sighs> me, it won't be that bad, that bad. You're making me very like nervous to see what you're gonna be like. That one was fine. Yeah, that one's not too bad. I feel like this one should be like after that one. This one catches a lot of people off guard. Trust me, you won't. You'll be fine until we get up to like here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. What advice would you give to someone looking to start a career in the media industry? Um, to just keep at it. Like, obviously there's so many people doing content creation now and it gets like discouraging, mm -hmm. but like just if you enjoy it and you're passionate about it, just keep doing it. Try to find like a little niche yeah, area exactly. kind of thing. Is there other, any other short shows in Newfoundland that do this whole exploring abandoned places or exploring anything in general? I don't think so. I know there's one guy who does it on NTV. Donnie, uh, Donnie Love, Love, he yeah. like camps out though. Yeah, he does some he does some more adventurous shit. Yeah. I like, watched an episode hikes. of him. <laughs> yeah. Not me. Is your new show up yet? No. Sights unseen? No. No? Okay. All Not right. yet. <laughs> Let's go. This one's blueberry. Mm. Um, this one's another crowd favorite. Okay. What are you taking? One bite? Yes. I won't be bullied. No. No one's bullying you. They're just so good, man. And I usually come hungry. Mmm. <laughs> You're Have actually beating the hell out of those wings. Yeah, I'm hungry. Have some more. I will not give in to peer pressure. Okay. I can't feel my tongue. Oh, wait, really? Already? Okay. That's good. I'm scared. <laughs> what do you mean already? Okay. Help! You Nurse! Got, you got so much stuff on the go, right? Your like show? mentally or? Well, I guess mentally, <laughs> mentally too, I guess. Okay, we'll throw that in there. You know, mental health, I guess. Um, you know, your show's... Uh, Sight, on, sight Unseen, right? Sight Unseen. Sight Unseen, Bannon and L. You got the podcast, Meddling Kids. How do you balance all those things? Um, well, we abandoned some of our projects. 
Yeah, but <laughs> I mean, you're still you're still busy. I'm assuming. Yeah. So for the podcast, we like gotten into like pre-recording like a block of episodes. So our last one we did three, and then we have three more to film, and we're just waiting for those to get back okay. to edit them. Okay. No. Cool. So the fifth wing, um, this is where it's gonna get a little bit more spicier. Okay, God love. Okay, this one's the same brand as this one, oh, just a Reaper. little bit hotter. Yep, this one got, yeah, so it's the Reaper and Black Cherry Sauce. Okay. Ready? <laughs> yes. We're halfway through. I fear that was too much. Okay, let's go, um, let's go back to five TV one. I'm really curious about this. How is it, uh, you know, I guess working with these guys, working with five TV one, how, like you had the show, right? Yes. And do they send producers to you? Do they send you camera equipment? Like how is the process of working with person? Well, we have a crew that travels with mm -hmm. us. Yeah, cool. So Fabian, the producer, hires the crew. Okay, no, I was just <laughs> curious. That, like it's, it's fun, it's cool. It's cool, it's cool to work on, I guess. Yeah, it is. Sweet. It's great. I've met some great friends through them. Mm -hmm. Some pains in the ass, Wes. Sorry, I'm you. All right, let's go on to the sixth one. This is my favorite. Oh, okay. This is the Scorpion. Okay. <laughs> um, and after this one, it's all downhill, okay? Oh, okay, perfect. Let's go. It gets worse. Yes, it does. Mmm. That tastes like rubber. It's my favorite sauce. I don't like it. No? <gasps> Hot. I feel like the SpongeBob when he's the caveman, and he's like... Oh, yeah. I remember that episode. That's how I feel. Yeah. Mmm, that was so good. Mmm. Oh, my God, don't say it like that. You sound like that girl on TikTok. What girl? That pinky doll girl. Oh, the like, mm, AI so guy? Yeah. Would you do that? No. You wouldn't even try it? Maybe. She makes a lot of money doing I know. that. And so do a lot of people. Like, I'm scrolling through and I see like, like grandparents doing it and shit now. Like random people doing it. <laughs> grandparents. I'd pay the grandparents. Yeah. Maybe they're hungry. Right? Okay. Before we get into the two, two hot stuff, um, we'll finish off with... How do you handle, you know, you're, you're doing these shows, right? And you, there's obviously some scary parts to it. You, like, you try to think that there's paranormal stuff going on. Okay, well, do you ever actually be in fear yourself? Yes, all the time. How do you handle that? Basically, I just, I'm like, this won't last forever, so I'll leave. Mm -hmm. Just like, right now. <laughs> yeah, like, you'll get through this. You'll get home eventually. Yeah. You know. Yeah. We haven't really seen much paranormal stuff, honestly. No? Okay, well, I want to ask another follow-up question on it. What do you think of like the ghost hunter shows and stuff like that on Detour? I think that's all fake. You do, you do? Yeah. Wow. I didn't expect you to say, I thought you'd be like, I'll for it. Yeah, I just feel like spirits, like if they want to be seen, it's not going to be on TV. Like they no. end like... Forced kind of. Yeah. As like, well. I don't like the Buzzfeed Unsolved boys love them. And I believe everything they do is real, but like Ghostbusters, Sorry, not Ghostbusters. <laughs> Ghost Hunters. <laughs> Ghost Hunters mm -hmm. and like stuff like that. I don't think that's real. No. All right, ready? No. Now we kick it into third gear. I'm sweating already. Mm, okay, I can't wait. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> don't be afraid of that one. I am. It's orange. Yeah, the orange ones That means ones it's are spicy yeah. if it's mm -hmm. orange. Mm -hmm. No one's looking at you, believe me. Are you able to speak on any funny moments? Or interesting moments. I don't think I'm able to speak at all right now. That one hot? Ooh wee. Yeah? Okay, so your new show, are you allowed to speak on that at all? Ah! We got some milk, you want some milk? No, I'm good. You're good? Okay, funny moments, interesting moments on your new show. Um, when we were in Lansing Meadows seeing the Vikings, there was a little vole running around. What's that? It's like a mouse, but like a sphere. That's what it looked like, right? I don't really know much of anything right now. I'm fighting for my life. A lot of people black out halfway through this. What? <laughs> like hit the floor? Well, no, like they just, they don't know where, like they're not thinking straight kind of thing. Oh, okay. All right, ready to go to the next one? I didn't answer the question. Oh, you, there was more to that story? Yeah, he was okay. just, okay. there was one of the Vikings, he was sat up on like the bench and he the bull would like back up and like charge the, the Viking. Viking? Yeah. Well, like attack him? Yeah, I don't know for, what he was doing. For no reason. Would you I'm be afraid of rabies? I was, and I wanted to pick them up. All right, let's go. 1.5 million Scoville this one is. This one was, I believe, 260 something. So it's a pretty big jump. Oh, okay. Okay? Yeah. Ooh-wee. All right, let's go. Why did I do this? 
I'm just staring at it. Okay. <sighs> okay, I know I already brought up the meddling kids, but is it gonna make a comeback at all? It is, we're changing it up a little bit though. Okay. Yeah. How so? We're trying to stay away from true crime, like not doing fully like true crime all the time because it does take its toll on the mental. Well, you gotta do a lot of research too. Like you shouldn't yeah. just be able to go on your podcast and enjoy yourself. Yeah. Shoot shit. Because people would probably rather that anyways. Yeah. We're rather just, than have to like stick to one topic, you know what I mean? Yeah, we do like little stories on it as well besides true crime because like I said, it gets kind of hard to do like that all the time. Mm -hmm. Especially when we're talking about children and stuff. Yeah. So. You gotta be careful what you're saying too, I guess. Yeah, as well. especially when we're doing local cases. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's get into this next one. And um, <laughs> before we do so, what's the deal? I was scrolling through Twitter, your Twitter. No! <laughs> what? What do you mean? I was scrolling through your Twitter earlier, and there was this uh, tweet like a couple months ago. Is it about Colin Hollett? No, it's not. It's, oh, I thought it's you were not. gonna say because you it's, said watch the deal with this. Call no, no, no. Watch the deal with this word that apparently your dad Don't said to you. Don't fucking say it. Do you know what I'm talking about? I know what you're gonna say. What is it? The L word. It is, yeah. Don't fucking Why, say it. Why is it that bad? Ooh, don't say it. Oh my god. Don't say it. I won't say it. I won't say it. I was just curious. Ooh. Like, it's actually a thing. Oh. Can you say it yourself? Yeah, I'll say it. Okay. Yeah. So, what's the thing? What's the it's deal with that? It's just so fucking gross. Like, really? I fuck, it's just the word. Is it like the that moist word people said? Like yeah, like same I just kind of picture. Larvae. Ew, stop. Ew. All right, let's go. Get bitten. This one's six million scoble. Oh, that's crazy. Black mamba. Eat some more. Eat as much as you can. Okay. Just dive into it. Fuck it. Shut. Your viewers are gonna love the this. Fuck up. Your viewers are gonna love this. Dive into it. Yeah, they're gonna love it. Dive into these nuts. And then, and then, and then you'll have nice clips. Let's go. Mmm, black mamba. Yum. Mmm, that was. So <laughs> eat more, Brie. You got it. It's not that bad. How much of this did Cord eat? She ate everything. The whole thing. She ate the whole wing. Yeah. She did not. She, she told did. me about the Squidward meme. What Squidward meme? Like oh, that. oh, like, yeah, like when, like, you yeah, kind of bite a little bit off the curry patty. Mm -hmm. well, she, did do, she did do good, though. Now, she also did drink, like, four yeah. liters. No, no, eat that. No, my tongue just touched it. <gasps> it's not that bad. Is it? Oh, my God, call search and rescue. <laughs> well, I have something else I wanted to ask you. When you do these shows, is there, like, no nope. message or anything? Nope. No. I guess you wouldn't need it. I don't even think we have first aid training, do we? Okay. Do you go on the show with her? Because I need it right now. So she goes with you all around? Yeah. Ooh-wee. I didn't even eat that. Ooh-wee. Ooh-wee. Oh, my God. I need CPR. Okay. This is the NFOE. This is one that we're going to spot us with. Okay. Okay. We'll get this. We'll ask you one more question, and then we'll Thank get out of here, okay? Hand. All right, let's go. NFOD from winging it. What does that mean? This is no fear of death. Oh. This is the one that you had to go to wing it for and sign a waiver for. Oh. Let's go. I'm going cross-eyed, I think. It'll happen. <sighs> It'll get really, really hot. Mmm, I got a little chicken with that one. This one's hot as fuck. Oh, okay, great. What's next for Brie? Milk. You want some milk? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Cora didn't even use the glass. She just drank the whole thing. Oh, we. What's next for you? Probably oh, but I'm like curious. Hospice. After this. Hospice, yeah. I want to do like For your own podcast. Directing. Okay, really? <sighs> if I survive. Okay, ready to go? We'll do, we'll do the outro. Brief, brief, follow it. Fall it. Fall it. <laughs> brief, follow it. God. Is that your TikTok, Instagram? Yeah. TikTok is four T's. Okay. Instagram is just Brianna Fall it. And what's YouTube? I just meddling kids. Okay. And they, they can like, explain to them where exactly they can get this on Sights Unseen show because I couldn't, I didn't couldn't find it myself. It's on Bell 5 TV one, so you have to have Bell to see it. So you click that like menu button where album comes up. Yeah, for like then, demand. Okay, so it's in demand. <laughs> yeah. There you go. We've got a tear. We've got a tear. All right, Brie, well, thank you for on the show. I really do appreciate it. Um, oh, one more thing. No. Cord said to ask you a question. Cord said to ask you a question. One more thing, real quick. Mock beggar witch. Ah! What is that? Okay. Do you have time to briefly explain it? Yes, okay. 
So when we went to Moff Beggar, Where's, the plantation is out in Bonavista. I was telling my dad about where we had gone. And he asked me if I knew about the Mock Beggar Witch, who was a witch who put a curse on my grandfather when he was a young boy. Okay. And he found out it was her, so he cursed her back to where she couldn't pee. He corked her. He corked her? Yeah. So she was like filling up with pee. <coughs> is this a true story? No. Yeah. Really? It is true, yeah. No. It is. Yes, boy. And so, to make a long story fucking short, yep, yep. Um, they like dropped each other's curses on each other and the witch like pissed herself everywhere. How long ago was this? A long time ago. So you say your family is related to this whole thing? Yeah, like, oh, okay. like my grandmother, my great grandmother on my mom's side, she could read people's futures through like playing cards. Oh. And my pop, he could like hex off warts on people's hands and worms would lay flat in his hands. Like your pop or like your great great grandmother? My dad's oh. grandfather, so my great grandfather. Wow. Wow. On my dad's side. See, this is something that I would have, I would never have known. Really. Yeah. So when we went to Mock Beggar, as we were going into the plantation, as I was putting my hand on the doorknob, a flat, like a clash of thunder went off, and it was the only one. Yeah. So when I told my dad that, he was like, "Oh my God! Like she knows. Like yeah. you're his offspring." And like my dad doesn't believe in ghosts or anything like that. And I saw like legitimate, like real fear in his eyes when I told him I'd gone there. Wow. Well, that's a cool story. Your family supports all this ghost stuff? Um, my dad doesn't believe in ghosts. And my, on my mom's side, like my whole family collectively agrees that Ouija boards are not to be spoken about, not to be fucked with. Yeah, yeah. Can't bring them in the house, can't speak about them in the house, can't use them. I think that's a pretty general statement on that, though. Like, no one really. I can't, I'm the like, same way. When my, like, my mother's mom was alive, I wasn't even allowed to speak of Ouija boards. No, they're cursed. Yes, they sort are. Of, sort of. I mean, you'll never know until you get in your own house. Well, to me, like, if a spirit wants to be seen, it'll make itself known. Yeah, if like you said. look out, if you, like, seek out spirits, like, you're not always getting what you think you are. No. Quote of the day. Quote of the day. All right, Bray, well, thanks for coming to the show. I really appreciate it. Yeah, it's been a um, really great time. Do you want to take one more boy for the road? No, I'm good. You're good? Uh, All right. Thank you. All right, cool. Um, if you guys enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe, and comment down below. If you think you can be on the show, um, reach out to our admin team, let them know, apply, <laughs> go through the whole process. And uh, also, uh, what is it, like 85% of y'all are not subscribed? Make sure you guys are subscribing, okay? Much love. Bye-bye.